I have an experience for you that will take you back to high school. Do you remember when you looked under a microscope for the first time? Or maybe with eyes that could really see when you were old enough to comprehend it? It is an unbelievable thing. Things that are blind to your human sight become revealed and you literally become astonished at the intricacy of the world. Well, I pray in other ways that as an adult, your eyes are opened up, that you have a vision that is brand new, that you have eyes that are open to all possibilities, even now with all the difficulties. I know we can be blinded by the difficulties. We can be blinded by the news reports. We can be blinded, but let's see deeper. Let's see with the eyes of God. If you have an opportunity to observe something in a new way, you will find that the more that you increase the magnification, it becomes something that before, just a second before, you were blind to. But now you see, like the old religious tune, I was blind, but now I see. Well, the same holds true for situations in your life that are still in the process of being resolved. If you focus only on the problem, you will be drawn closer to it. It will become a mountain that you cannot pass. In an attempt to analyze it, rather than keeping an open mind and being objective, you can become completely involved in your perception that is distorted. But instead, you backtrack just a moment spiritually, and you take a minute by closing your eyes, and you focus on God's and God's overall plan. And when you do, you are able to look with a new vision, God's vision of truth and order. It says in Ephesians, be renewed in the spirit of your minds and put on the new nature. I pray that this happens to you. I pray that you are renewed, that you have a new vision to see things that are coming, things that are good, things that are God-ordained, and that you're able to see that God is indeed in charge and that all is coming together for your life according to a perfect divine plan of good.